Leading Symptoms in Pediatric Surgery is a learner program developed by the Education and Media Unit of the Institute of Medical Education at the Faculty of Medicine, University of Bern. It was conceived by Professor Georges-Louis Kaiser. The use of this program is free of charge. Medical professionals can get a certificate in this learner program. Before using the program for the first time, you have to register. State your data correctly and completely. It's important that you give your correct email address in order for the password to be delivered to you. The learner program may only be used according to the terms of use which you have to accept on the order form. You will find the email with your username and password in your inbox. In case the message is overdue, look in your spam file too. If you don't find it there either, please contact us by email. kco at iml.unibe.ch To log in, click on the link Start Program. You will be asked for username and password. Your username is your complete email address that you have used for your application. After completing your login, you can choose from three modules which are briefly introduced below. Module 1, Diseases, presents the pathologies relevant to clinical practice categorized after body regions. The pathologies are described on the basis of their main symptoms. You choose an entry. As an example, we consider the symptoms of back masses. The symptoms heading is specified now. Masses, fistulas and cutaneous anomalies of the back. The individual symptoms are illustrated by one to three illustrations under their respective headings. The description of the symptoms includes various characteristics such as occurrence, clinical importance, etiology, pathology, pathophysiology, clinical manifestation, course of disease, differential diagnosis, additional examinations, therapy and prognosis. You can have most text read out to you by a computer-generated voice. Many characteristics are illustrated by pictures. Each illustration in the right-hand column refers to an in-depth discussion of the characteristics. Click the picture for further explanations, complete with additional illustrations displayed in a new window in which you can navigate linearly by means of arrows. You can generally zoom into pictures by clicking on them. You can also click the subtitles to directly call up a specific explanation. Close the window and you will be back on the initial symptoms main page. On each page there is a footer providing links to the German version of the program, to the discussion forum and to the search engine. Enter one or more keywords in the query form. The more words you enter, the more specific is the hit list. Let us look now at the details of dyspnea in the newborn. Please note that some pictures are stills from videos. You can recognize the videos by the play video button. On each main page in the learner program there is a header for navigation. Click module 1 diseases to return to symptoms selection. Module 2 is a self-test in differential diagnosis. There is a number of thematic sets in alphabetical order for you to choose from. Let us now look at the set Back Masses as an example. Two pictures or groups of pictures are presented next to each other. For example, radiological and intraoperative photos as well as phenotypes of seemingly similar symptoms. Above the pictures, you find additional information in text form. 
solve the problem by assigning the correct answer on the left and on the right. You get immediate feedback, complete with explanations. Find the correct answer above the pictures. If you have chosen the wrong answer, the pair of pictures will be repeated later until you have chosen the correct solution. To continue your training, click Next Question. Once you have worked your way through a thematic set, you are informed about your score of correct and false answers. Let's go now from Module 2 to Module 3. This is a quiz module in the form of a multiple choice test. Let us look at an example of an MC test. The first paragraph contains a short introduction to the topic, followed by an explanation of the picture or the pictures, as well as the initial question. Each question is answered with 2 to 10 assertions. You decide which assertions are correct and which ones are not. After working your way through the MC quiz, you will receive a summary. In order to reflect the world as seen through children's eyes, the pages are decorated with drawings by children. In the must-head, you will find a link to the gallery of the drawings. We hope you enjoy the program and wish you good results. You'll find it on the internet at www.kco.com kco.unibe.ch